is this thing on hey guys it's olivia welcome back to my channel today we're going to be doing a very exciting video we're going to be talking about what is in my bag the premise of these videos are very painfully obvious so i don't think you guys need an explanation of what this video is but we are going to be reviewing everything that is in my everyday bag for starters the bag is from aliexpress i've seen a lot of people have similar ones it is supposed to be a dupe of the stod oil bag for example yunjin from the seraphim has the same exact bag but obviously i paid like 10 bucks for mine versus the i think 150 dollars it is i could be wrong on that as you can see i also jane birkenfied the bag as tiktok likes to call it i added a bunch of different ribbons i added some white ribbon some gingham ribbon and a couple different keychains this one is a two-sided bts keychain from shop soul sunny then i also have this rj keychain on here from bt21 and a little jungkook so far away keychain that i got from private paradise co but put a little picture of jungkook in the bag itself features two zippers on top which is super convenient because most of the time i just have it zipped like this and if i'm at the store and need to check out really quickly i can just open it up like that and this is an overview of everything that is in my bag i'm just going to be pulling out stuff randomly because as you can see it's not very organized the first thing i have in my bag is my baggy sunglass case this is obviously from Bagu, and in here I have a pair of sunglasses. These are supposed to be a gentle monster dupe. These are also from AliExpress, but obviously I cannot afford the real gentle monster glasses, so I'm gonna have to settle for these ones. They are obviously way too big for my face, but that's okay because when I'm driving, I usually do have to wear my regular prescription glasses, and so when I drive, I basically put these on top of my prescription glasses is definitely not supposed to do that but that is what i do so yeah next thing i'm pulling out is this little coin pouch this is a obviously mong coin pouch i don't remember exactly where it's from i got it so so many years ago but in here i basically just keep receipts coins i have a free breakfast sandwich coupon <laughs> i also have just a little bit of cash. I try not to keep cash on me because most of the time I forget that I have it and I just pay with card anyway, but I do have some cash that I gotta spend, so maybe I need to go shopping after this. My wallet that I use for my actual credit cards is pretty small, so I have them separated into two different like card holders. This one is from Walmart. It's supposed to be like a Bottega dupe with the woven this on it i literally got this in the walmart clearance section for a dollar and in here i just keep random gift cards i keep a little new york city metro card even though i haven't been to the city in like two years but there is still money on this that i will have to use eventually and then i also just keep random you know bath and body works gift card i got a dick's sporting good gift card i also have michael's gift cards yeah these are just all my gift cards so that when i'm out and about and i remember that oh shoot i have a michael's gift card and i'm at michael's i remember to use it because if i didn't have my gift cards with me at all times they would literally never be used now for my actual card holder this is from nick bental studios if you look at it it's supposed to be a manila folder which is just super cute in my opinion um this was like around 60 ish dollars so a little bit expensive compared to obviously everything else i'm showing but yeah i love it obviously in here i keep my credit cards debit cards not going to show you guys that my driver's license and my library card i will show you guys my library card however just because it is so dang cute i'm going to cover up the name of the library that i go to but look at it it's snoopy ho stinking cute is that it literally just says read adventure awaits when i was applying for my library card and i saw that they had this option it was pretty much a no-brainer i was like please let me have the snoopy version of the library card because i love snoopy he is just so dang cute next up this is kind of a no-brainer just a pack of kleenex i cry all the time sorry that was a little bit depressing but i do cry all the time and so i do need tissues and also you know cold season's about to hit us probably gonna be sick a bunch of times tissues it's just a no-brainer necessity that i have in pretty much every bag that i have 
also with me i carry a pack of dental floss these ones are from mini so they are supposedly apple flavored but when i use them i don't really taste any apple which is good because i prefer mint flavored dental hygiene products anyway but these are so cute um obviously from mini so like i said i keep a pack of mints in my bag at all times if they're not mints like this, just typical peppermints, I usually like to carry the Listerine strips or the Listerine spray just because I don't have any in my bag right now, but the Listerine products like Listerine mints, they also have little mini toothbrushes. Listerine products are the best in terms of mints, but however, I do have some of these little organic peppermints from Traders that I still have quite a few of. Lastly, for this bag, we are pretty much just getting into all the random stuff at the bottom. First, I have my everyday perfume. This is Black Opium by YSL. Yes, it is basic. Yes, pretty much everybody wears it, but I do not care. It is my favorite. My friend actually got me this little mini travel size, which is perfect because I just leave this in my bag all the time. Whenever I need a quick fresh up, you know, this stuff smells so good if you don't know what this smells like please go into your local sephora or ulta and smell it because this is my favorite perfume of all time every single time i smell it on someone out in public i'm just like i love this scent i also always carry a little bottle of just rubbing alcohol this is great not only to sanitize your hands which is what i pretty much mainly use it for but also if i'm at a restaurant and the table's like kind of grimy like they didn't really clean it that well beforehand i just spray alcohol down um i am that obnoxious person also on the plane where i will spray down my seat i do not care if people are annoyed by the smell I don't care this stuff is essential for planes for traveling just anything I fill this up probably once a week honestly at this point this little reusable bottle is just from Amazon yeah lastly I again am like everybody else and have a ton of lippies in my bag this one is from Rode and does it say the color shade espresso that's that me espresso. Then I also have a little Rare Beauty lip balm in the shade Nearly Neutral. It's just a little lip balm. And I keep, lastly, a little Black Honey dupe from Bath & Body Works. This is just their nourishing lip tint with hyaluronic acid. It's pretty much the same shade as Black Honey, the Clinique one that everyone is obsessed with. But yeah, that's pretty much everything I keep in my everyday bag. I usually do tend to have more in my bagus just because they hold a lot more so if you would like a bagu version of this video please let me know and also there might be one already posted on my tiktok if you're not following my tiktok shameless self plug right here um follow me on tiktok but yeah i hope you guys this video leave a like let me know if i'm missing anything in my bag that i need to put in my bag and yeah stick around for more videos coming soon love ya